evening at 6 o'clock. I'm Sandra Bookman. Joe has the night off. We'll have those stories in just a minute, but we're going to begin tonight with exclusive new cell phone video that captures the moment a man behind the wheel of a van drives the wrong way up a Brooklyn street. You can see him barreling into several parked cars, even someone's front porch as people desperately try to stop him. Eyewitness News reporter Anthony Carlo is live this evening in East Flatbush with more. Anthony? Well, Sandra, eyewitnesses tell us they thought they heard a parade coming down the block. That's how loud it was. But when they looked out their window, it was quite the opposite. A driver coming down the wrong way, ping-ponging off of parked cars. You see one of them sustaining some damage to their mirror right there. And police have now arrested the driver, Ryan Austin, and hit him with a number of criminal charges, including driving while intoxicated, driving while impaired with alcohol, and reckless endangerment. This exclusive video obtained by Eyewitness News shows absolute chaos on East 94th Street Saturday night at around 10:30. The wrong way driver in that white van crashing into several parked cars while a group of neighbors tried desperately to stop him. My Jeep was right there and hit this car first when he there and then he tried to reverse and pull that car into my Jeep. The aftermath today, a number of banged up cars and shattered glass. But these images do no justice illustrating the destruction that happened last night. Police say the driver, Ryan Austin, was driving drunk as he barreled into car after car, reversing and then doing it again. There was a car make the turn coming up, coming this way, and then crashed straight into it and uh, lick it on the sidewalk. So a group of neighbors did everything they could to stop the driver, trying to punch their way through the driver's side window, some even throwing bricks. Police say six people suffered minor injuries. Neighbors we spoke with have no mercy. Good luck in jail. Could you? A lot of frustrated people out here today. Police have also charged the driver as an aggravated, unlicensed operator, and they say that he refused a breathalyzer. Again, police have charged the driver, Ryan Austin, with driving drunk. Uh, luckily, the six people in total who were injured in all of this suffered minor injuries, according to police. This, of course, was something that could have been much worse, even deadly. We're live.